Hi love. So right now I'm going to be talking to you about my curly hair routine. Um, I get this requested a lot. Uh, so I finally decided to show you guys. I'm doing a whole series on my curly hair care. You know, right now I'm going to be talking to you about my routine. Next is how I style it, actually style it. Then I'm going to do a video about my nighttime routine, deep treatments, hair growth, and you know a whole series just for you guys because I get a lot of questions and I figure I'd answer them for you in a whole, a whole series of videos. So first let me talk to you about my actual hair. <clears throat> so I'll put pictures up throughout the video but my hair used to be down to my butt. It was really long and in August of 2012 I cut my hair up to here. So I guess you can say that was my big chop. I cut it not because it was really damp. It really wasn't damaged. But it just wasn't where I wanted it to be. So I just decided to cut. I donated it to Lots of Love. It was really healthy. My hair is still really healthy. My hair care, honestly, my ends, they feel like they're freshly cut. And I haven't cut it since August. Because I take such good care of my hair. That I don't have any split ends. My hair is so healthy. It's growing at, at an amazing rate because of how I take care of it. And my regimen, if you want to grow your hair long, if you want your curls to be absolutely bouncy and beautiful, then um, then you just watch this video. Okay, so to start off, I wash my hair once a week. I co-wash it and I style, I leave it curl like this for three to four days, depending how my hair wants to act that week. And then for the rest of the days, my hair is slicked back in a bun. And when it's in a bun, it's in a treatment. So first, let me talk to you about what I co-wash my hair with. I co-wash my hair. I hope you can see with the Giovanni uh, conditioner, direct leave-in weightless moisture conditioner for all hair types. It has natural botanicals, they moisturize and detangles hair while infusing weightless body for easily styling. easy styling. Now this is the light conditioning one. It restores strength and luster, moisturizes and builds body and easy for detangling. All true, um, I use this in the shower. What I do is I wet my hair, I massage into my scalp, and then I finger comb. I don't use really any combs for my hair. I use just my fingers. And I finger comb it throughout my hair to give it real even. I do it twice. And then I put in a bun. And then um, when I'm ready to, when I finish washing my body and doing all the other stuff, when I'm ready to rinse it out, I'll flip my hair, wet it real quick, like take it out real quick. Just do like a, the mop twisting thing to just wring out any excess and that's it. I don't rinse out all the conditioner. I need conditioner. So because my hair is really dry, it's like a desert. So this is what I use to co-wash. And this you can get at Marshalls or on Amazon for about 10 to $12. So for styling, I use three products. Well, I, I guess four products. And I'll start off with, um, this is the first thing I put in my hair after I wash it. It's the Shea Moisture Yucca and Owl Thickening Growth Milk with Biotin and Bamboo Extract for Thin and Fine Hair. My hair isn't thin or fine, it's actually really thick. But I use this, this is what it looks like, to give it volume. Because I like my hair big, I don't like it flat, like big curly hair. So this is what I use for volume and this is no sulfates, no parabens. All the stuff I have is organic, there's no sulfates, parabens, nothing. So it's a little bit on the pricier side, like this I believe was 10 bucks at Walgreens. But it's worth it because my hair is really healthy, it's never been healthier. So. This is what I put first, and I just squeeze into my palm and I apply it to my hair. I'm gonna have a video on how I style it, but this is what I put in first. And then, this is my hair crack. I absolutely need this for my hair. I cannot live without it. It's my hair crack, like I fiend for it. And this is the Curl Enhancing Smoothie with coconut oil, stick protein, and neem oil for thick curly hair. My hair fiends for this. It loves it, it needs it. This I always get, I always repurchase this. I need to. So it's always in my, my product drawer. And I apply this to my hair afterwards, <clears throat> which provides extra moisture and holds. Then I'll apply Eco Styling Gel. My hair needs gel. I can't just rock it with, with oils. I wish I could. Some girls can, but my hair just doesn't like to behave. So I need to have some extra hold. This is maximum 10. And what I love about this gel, it's alcohol free. It doesn't get your hair crunchy. I don't like crunchy hair. You see my hair is moving, soft, bouncy. This is what it does for me. And I apply this in my hair as well. And then after that, yeah, it's a lot. I put a lot of products in my hair because I need it to last at least three days. So all this stuff may seem like a lot, but it, I need it to last me three days. So then after that, 
I I diffuse my hair because I don't like sitting around with wet hair. It's, it bothers me. So I put this Bio Infusion Daily Volume Blow Dry Balm and just in my roots so I can get more lift because once again, I like big curly hair. So this works. I love it. And then right before I blow dry, of course, use heat protectant. This is just a trust me heat protectant. I spray a whole bunch of my hair and then I diffuse it with, um, it's like a Remo or Walmart brand diffuser. It doesn't matter to me. I don't really spend a lot of money on blow dryers because it, they all work the same to me. As long as it has a diffuser on it, I'm good. After my hair is diffused, what I like to do is take a pick and you can get this like a dollar and just like use it use it just um like shake my roots up with it once again because I love big curly hair <clears throat> so next uh, for deep treatments I don't purchase deep treatments I just make them at home whatever in my kitchen I'll use I'll do avocado hair mask I'll do an egg protein hair mask uh, a mayonnaise hair mask and my favorite one I'll do a hot oil treatment I can show you videos on how I make those at home okay so what I'm going to talk about now is my favorite hot oil treatment and you can get this at Sally's it was $5.79 I think $5.19 with your Sally's card it is the Queen Helene jojoba hot oil treatment it contains pure jojoba oil this right here oh my god it will leave your hair feeling like butter and I mix it with this is also something you need for curly girls is organic virgin coconut oil and this is from Trader Joe's I got it on Amazon I forget for how much maybe $10 to $12 for this big old jar Curly hair loves, any hair, loves coconut oil, just eats it up, it provides moisture. So coconut oil, and let me show you what it, the consistency, if I can open it. Okay, the consistency, when you first take it out, as you can see, it's like a, I don't know if you can see actually, it's like a, it's, it's you can see it's thick, it doesn't go anywhere. But once you, you warm it up and you rub it between your fingers, it turns into an oil, it's like magic. So this, your hair loves it, it's basically food for your hair. So what I do is I take some of this into an applicator bottle and I mix it with this. And I heat it up in the microwave and I apply it all to my hair. Like some, It looks like my hair is wet but it's not, that's how much I put in it. And I stick it back to, into a bun and leave it for like two to three days. And when I wash it out, my hair is absolutely so soft. It feels like butter. My hair is so soft. This is one of the main reasons why my hair is so healthy because of these treatments. Now, for second day hair or third day hair, I use <clears throat> you, I need, you need a spray bottle. This one I got from so I don't know. Don't ask me how I got misshapen like this. I have no idea. It was round when I bought it, and now it's square. But I got this from Sally's, maybe three bucks. And in here is water and leave-in conditioner. And this is leave-in conditioner. This is the mixed chicks. I love this stuff. I use it. It's light enough so I can use it for second and third day hair when I need to wake it up. This together is what I use for second day hair. What I do is I spritz it in my hand, rub it, and put the conditioner on top, rub it in my hair, and I just rub it throughout my hair, let it dry, and it looks just like it did on the first day, if not better. When I just need to slick my hair back, my favorite thing for my to get my edges really smooth is this right here and I think it's how much is this this was 16 bucks it's a little pricey but a little bit goes a long way it's really thick like if I shake it out nothing's gonna happen it's called Hicks total transform transformation exclusive hair products Hicks edges this stuff will have your hair laid like smooth and my favorite brush to slick my hair back is this by it's from Sally's it's really tough because I have thick hair, so I need something really thick. And my hair gets smooth buns, <clears throat> which usually if you see my hair in a bun in my videos, it's because it's in a treatment. Once again, these are all organic. They're all natural, so it's a little on the pricey side. If you guys don't have the money for this, I'm sure you may find other things. But think about when you're going natural, you just got to have, you know, do your research, you know. Can you afford it? Are you going to be committed to it? Like I am. And... Another thing that you might need for your routine is a silk scarf. And you, I use a silk scarf to do a pineapple at night. If you don't know what that is, I'll show you my video. Just a silk head scarf. It's really big to fit it on your big head. You need it to be big. And you wrap your hair in it, and this helps it preserve the curls for the other two or three days. Like I said in the beginning of my video, I cut my hair, and I wanted, when I cut it, 
she did a lot of layers so it thinned my hair out a lot like I couldn't even put my hair in a ponytail for like a month I couldn't do anything with it but leave it curly I enjoyed it being short with my curly froze but once I hit about January I was like dang I want my hair to be bigger I want thick hair so I want my thick hair out my long hair so I started taking Berkley and Jensen hair skin and nail pills for beauty and wellness formula blah 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 it doesn't matter what all it says. If it has biotin, then I'm taking it for my hair. It's 2,500 mcg of biotin. And this comes with 200 caplets. Got it from BJ's. I was like, wow, 200 for 12 bucks. That's not bad. So I'm actually almost done. This stuff smells, by the way. It smells really bad. It makes me nauseous. I take it two or three times a day, which helps my hair grow. My hair, if I stretch it out for you guys. Let me see. Let me get it. It's down in here okay so that's a lot compared to here and that's in less than a year that must be about seven inches of growth so far and it hasn't even been a year so my regimen is proven to work if you're trying to grow healthy hair if you just want healthy hair in general my regimen is it I worked long and hard I bought a lot of products just to perfect my beautiful regimen but everybody's hair is different. Use whatever works for you. Experiment. The whole point of finding a regimen is experimenting with different products in order for you to find your own personal hair regimen. I'm just showing you mine because maybe you do have really dry hair and you really want to know how to get moisturized, bouncy curls. Not frizzy. I actually like a little bit of frizz. But not overly frizzy that this is what you may need. Or you may need less moisture. Or you even may, may more moisture. Need more moisture. It all depends on your hair. So I will tell you, have fun with this. Um, it is going to be a little pricey, but I believe it's worth it. Once you find your regimen, this is my regimen. That's it. I don't think I'm going to change it. This really works for me. I really love curly hair. I adore it. If you have curly hair, embrace it. Don't try and hide it with burning it, straining it. I love my curly Even though it's high maintenance, I love it. I wish it was even curlier. I just love it. Just embrace it embrace the wildness I, it's beautiful i hope it made sense because i feel like i'm jumping everywhere upcoming videos they may it should make more sense when i show you how i apply it makeup is a prom lick lick a prom look that i did i hope you enjoyed it love you guys embrace the curls and stay envious and stay beautiful as always Mwah.